Prince Harry visits UK solo after Duchess Kate suffers from cancer. Prince Harry hopes to return to the UK later this year, but insiders say he plans to meet Prince William and Princess Kate. Prince Harry is set to return to the UK soon after it was revealed that his sister-in-law, the Princess of Wales, has been diagnosed with cancer. Hello viewers! If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell so you don't miss any news about the British royal family. But while many would have hoped that this shocking news would pave the way for a possible reconciliation between the estranged Duke of Sussex and his older brother Prince William, information close to the Welsh couple sources reportedly suggest otherwise. Prince Harry is scheduled to attend a service at St. Paul's Cathedral in May to mark the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games, but he has lost a legal battle with the government over police protection in the country. It is highly unlikely that Prince Harry will attend the ceremony. According to The Telegraph, he is accompanied by either his wife Meghan Markle or his children Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. Sources close to the Prince and Princess of Wales have revealed that the Harry issue is not on their minds as they currently have much bigger concerns that require their full attention. Meanwhile, another source told the magazine over the weekend that Prince William has always done everything in his power to protect his family. But insiders believe the heir to the throne and his family will find that he dismissed any suggestion that he might have mental abilities. He confronts the Duke, who himself has become estranged. Princess Kate doesn't need narcissistic Meghan Markle to help her recover from cancer royal writers says Princess of Wales has plenty of support from those around her, and that both Prince Harry and Meghan Markle don't need narcissistic Meghan Markle to help her recover from cancer was not necessary. The Princess of Wales doesn't need Prince Harry and Meghan Markle to comfort her as she receives a shock cancer diagnosis, a royal expert has insisted after announcing her cancer diagnosis. Royal biographer Sally Bedell-Smith claimed that Kate had a family of her own and that the royal family provided sufficient support to treat her illness. She told New York Times columnist Maureen Dowd, Kate doesn't need Harry and Meghan to comfort her. She has her parents and younger sister and is very close to King Charles. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex say the future queen has been diagnosed with cancer. Prince William and Princess Kate, who were said to have been diagnosed with cancer on the same day they announced that they had been diagnosed with cancer, contacted private. They also released an official statement that read, We wishes Kate and her family health and healing and hopes they can find peace in their private lives. Earlier this week, Ms. Smith dominated the headlines when she compared the Sussexes to Wallace Simpson and King Edward VIII. She criticized Meghan and her husband for being very narcissistic, very controlling, and very domineering. Ms. Smith said, Meghan and the Duchess of Windsor have similar characteristics in some ways very narcissistic and very controlling. She had been diagnosed with cancer and was currently undergoing preventive chemotherapy. The shocking announcement comes after weeks of wild speculation and conspiracy theories about her fate and whereabouts. Now, Ms. Smith said Kate's bold move disproves further conspiracy theories and she hopes she can recover. She said, I think they need to leave her alone. The palace will make sure that they leave her alone. I think they need to leave her alone. It would be scary if they came after me. I hope they show some common sense, although maybe not to a great extent. I wish people would stop speculating about all sorts of horribly ridiculous things.